स्टार्च सो एज यू नो स्टार्च इज द रिजर्व फूड मेटीरियल फॉर द हायर प्लांट्स एंड ऑल्सो फाउंड इन द सीरियल्स लेग्यूम्स पोटैटोज एंड अदर वेजिटेबल दिस स्टार्च इट कंसिस्ट ऑफ टू कंपाउंड दैट इज अमाइलोज एंड अमाइलोपैक्टिन now first amylose so amylose is a unbranched it is a straight chain structure like here this is the structure of amylose and thus amylose is consist of glucose molecule which are alpha d glucose and these are attached with itself with themselves by the linkage that is alpha 14 linkage you can clearly see here these are the alpha d glucose molecules and these are linked with each other by this bonding that is alpha 14 linkage so this is the structure of amylose this starch it also consists of amylopectin which is a branched chain molecule and here the linkages are alpha 14 but they also linked by alpha 16 linkages which will be clear in this diagram here this is the simple you can say the structure of amylose means the glucose molecule they are linked with alpha 14 linkage but in order to make the amylopectin there will be the linkage alpha 16 as you clearly see now this chain of alpha 14 linked glucose molecule attached with this below chain of glucose molecule with the linkage that is alpha 16 so you can clearly see in case of amylopectin there are two kind of linkage one is alpha 14 and second is alpha 16 so starch is formed of these two amylose and amylopectins so cellulose as you know it is a major part it forms a major part of the plant cell wall and it generally consists of very long linear chains of beta d glucose which are linked with beta 14 linkages as this is the structure of cellulose in which these are the beta d glucose molecules and which are linked with each other by this beta 14 linkages so cellulose just consists of beta d glucose linked with each other by this beta 14 linkages